Lions making a weird late night trade with the New York Jetskis. Uh, Lions trading away a 2025 sixth round conditional pick and receiving wide receiver Denzel Mims and a 2025 seventh round pick. Uh, when you look at the trade, it makes sense in the fact that the Lions are in need of some help in the wide receiver room. Why not add a little bit of competition in there? Because with Jamison Williams out for the first six weeks, you got Amon Ross St. Brown who's locked it down. After that, Khalif Raymond, Josh Reynolds, you have some of these guys where I really think Mims will just offer competition. He's going to offer competition against the likes of Marvin Jones and Raymond. Now, Mims has a lot of work to do still in the NFL. He hasn't caught a TD yet. He's 42 for 92 in the NFL. Now, granted, he does have Zach Wilson throwing to him, so there's that. But it has been seen that, like, you know, his contested or going up for contested passes, not a, he's not great at it. He has a lot of athletic potential. You see it in his body type being just about 6'3", a little over 200 pounds. His body type offers, hey, man, this guy could be an athletic stud out there. We just haven't seen it yet. So what you're looking at is lines and a little competition right before training camp begins. And there's nothing wrong with that. It'll be interesting to see how he does, see how he fares with Goff in this offense. But hey, man, I, I think bringing in Mims, it's just sort of like, ah, let's get the competition going. Let's get the boys going as we head into training camp. But that's the news. Lions making late night moves while I was sleeping interesting movie while you were sleeping it's mom i think it's my mom's favorite if i'm not mistaken rookies have reported training camp is here i mean we got like two more days before the, the veterans return but it's happening that is it keep you updated as we go through training camp and until next time it's later on let's talk lines